The Trotters have reached the back stretch, and they are underway. On the far outside, Breckenridge stepping out. Diehard Sealster center of the track with an early bolt, and uh, he takes the lead by about a long neck as Breckenridge comes up into second. Back on the inside third, Marion Gondolier. Pure Hope positions herself fourth in the mid-pack right in front of Mac Morris Hanover, and comes Dagon Hanover. Winning Legends is the early trailer. So it's diehard Sealster who leads the way. They wing around the turn and get to the quarter mile marker, 26 and four. So a peppy pace here for the Trotters. Diehard Sealster on top. Uh, this one is the four to five favorite on the drop in class and being challenged for the lead now by Breckenridge. Braxton Boyd having none of that, keeping the pedal on diehard Sealster. So Breckenridge parked at the moment. A gap back to third and Marion Gondolier is now Breckenridge tucks back in the pocket. The three year old Philly Pure Hope is fourth as they round the turn. Then comes Mac Morris and over Dagon Hanover and winning legends. The half mile 54 and 4, 28 even. Second panel, those are uh, fractions not for the timid of spirit here, especially on the trot here in the slop. That's what diehard Sealster's laying down. Breckenridge still perched right behind. Pure Hope begins a first over move now for George Knapp just to the outside of Marion Gondolier. Brings along with her Mac Morris Hanover. Back on the inside, Dagon Hanover itching to get out and winning legends still the trailer. Diehard Sealster by a length at the three quarter mile marker, 124 and three, 29 and four third panel. So much softer on the back stretch there. Diehard Sealster watching now as Pure Hope pulls right up alongside. Mac Morris Hanover following up that move still in the pocket is Breckenridge. They round the turn to the top of the stretch. Pure Hope takes that lead away from the tiring Diehard Sealster. In the meanwhile, Mac Morris Hanover trying to follow up the move of the Philly. It's Pure Hope by a length and a half. Mac Morris Hanover not gaining. Pure hope uh, the uh, Philly uh, is able to beat the older Trotters here and win it by a length and a quarter for George Knapp. Mac Morris Hanover second, followed by uh, Breckenridge third and winning Legends fourth. It's Pure Hope in 155 flat. Pace just got away from the favorite diehard Sealster, 54 and four to the half, even on a fast track, that'd be quick for these. And here it was in the slop. And so she started to feel it, pure hope. George Knapp sensing the opportunity, first over moving. And she is able to pull up even and pull past and hold off uh, the uh, two horse Mac Morris Hanover who was following up her cover. Judges have posted the unofficial order of finish race 12. Number five, Pure Hope finished first. Number two, Mac Morris Hanover finished second. Number seven, Breckenridge finished third. Number six, Winning Legends finished fourth. Unofficially, 5276 race 12. Heading back to the Hanover Shoe Farms winner's circle. Unofficial winner race 12. Number five, Pure Hope. Swedish bred three year old Brown Philly by Brilliant Is Me. Out of uh, Final Hope by Jokey Face. Bred by Marco Cravey of Sweden. Owned by Soderberg Bloodstock LLC of Lexington, Kentucky. Ocas Fonstedt, the trainer. George Napolitano Jr. is second straight win on the program. And it's Pure Hope, two to one second choice back in from Canada. She won the last time she was here on Sunstake Saturday against her own age. It's her third win in nine this year. Her sixth lifetime victory career earnings now topping $133,000. Time of the mile in the slop is 155 flat for number five, Pure Hope. <laughs> 